You'll, uh, use a knife? Yes, the knife will be okay. And then afterwards, I remove the rings and bracelets and the jewelry in the bureau drawer because our client wishes it to look like simple robbery. <laughs> Don't worry. Everything's okay. Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Alasia if you're new. And if you're returning, thank you so much. We have entered fall, and we know this. We've talked about it a thousand times. The thing is this though, I didn't really specify what fall really meant as far as content. We're going to be in this kitchen. We're going to be making new meals. We're going to be making new desserts. We're going to be making traditional meals, traditional desserts, which brings me into today's video. We will be making homemade-ish pumpkin bread. I don't think I've ever had pumpkin bread and I damn sure have never made pumpkin bread. So we, I'm excited. All right. We will be using this pumpkin bread kit. I did go ahead and pick this up at Walmart. I think all of like six, seven dollars I spent on this. Let's just open her up. Open her right up. Oh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and preheat the oven really quick. Like, let's just go ahead and get us started. I did go ahead and preheat the oven to 350 degrees per the instructions. So just to give you guys a close up, this is what the box is looking like. When I tip it over, this is what she's looking like. This is icing mix. Okay, now we making my own icing. This is the pumpkin bread mix. And this is the pumpkin can. So we have preheated the oven. Off camera, I did go ahead and prep the pumpkin can. The first step is to combine eggs, water, oil, and the pumpkin filling. But it doesn't say how many eggs. Do I use all four? Stir in one cup, sweet and dry. Okay guys, I don't know if I'm supposed to use all four eggs. I'm assuming so because none of the other steps talk about eggs. So, oh, it looks like baby food, like carrot baby food. Kind of smells like it too. Okay. Now I'm gonna go ahead and crack the eggs. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and do all four. Like we're just gonna do it. If you guys watched my last video, we did go ahead and color our eggs. There we go. One thing I do know about myself is I do like baking. I just don't like the mess. <laughs> okay, let's, I'm gonna go ahead and get a towel just to keep over here for my hands because I'm sure we'll get a little messy. Okay, what is the next step? Water, oil, okay. How much water and oil? One cup of water and a half a cup of vegetable oil. I feel like this seems like a lot of vegetable oil. I'm gonna go ahead and do half a cup. Like you say. It says half a cup, right? Like I'm sure it says half a cup. Okay. I'm pretty sure it says half a cup. Let me check one more time, cause. Half a cup. Yeah, half a cup of vegetable oil. All right. Uh, all right, we got our vegetable oil in there. And now we just need one cup of water. Next step, it says mix until it's well blended. See, I definitely have one of those like cake whisks. <gasps> Why am I not using that? Hold on. I had a bigger one. I had a red one and I don't know where it's at. I'm just gonna go ahead and use the green one. What I was originally gonna say was I have the electrical one, but I didn't wanna do that during the video. And I was like, girl, wait, you definitely have the manual one. So we're just gonna go ahead and stir it. I'm not gonna lie, let me read the rest of the instructions. Pour batter into prepared pans. I'm wondering when does pouring the bread come into play? Combine eggs, water, oil, and Libby's 100% pure pumpkin in a bowl. It has, it says nothing about this bag. Step three, pour batter into prepared pans. Bake as directed. Am I like, you know what? I think what it meant to say was put this in there. Right? Like it isn't, it literally doesn't say bread mix at all. 
It does not say bread mix at all. It doesn't say bread mix at all. Am I tripping? Oh, add bread mix. Got it. Okay. I, yeah. It says it right there. I'm crying. <laughs> that makes so much more sense. I'm like, this is a lot of oil for a can of pumpkin mix. We are making bread, you guys. That's what we're looking like. I'll try to hold it. She smells good. Okay, my arm's hurting. This is heavy. To be honest with you, I've like never even made bread. And I honestly, I really want to try that. That might be something that I do next is like make homemade bread. But isn't that like a couple day process? Am I tripping or no? So I just want to show you guys what we're looking like. She's looking good, right? She's thick. All right, you guys. So yeah, this is what we are looking like. I can't tip them over too much or they'll fall. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and place these in the oven and then we'll get started on our cheesecake, pumpkin bread, muffin bites. And let's go. Oh, it's not helping me because I'm not going off of, damn. Okay, 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 just chill out, chill out, chill out. Okay, so we're just gonna go ahead and try to bake these for like 45 minutes. And you're watching Disney Channel. <laughs> On to the next step. If you did watch my DIY cheesecake video, this should look very familiar. Um, I went ahead in that video and got two. I never used the second one. So we will be using her. I never set an alarm. I never set an alarm. I never set an alarm for the pies, the bread. I'm so excited because at this point I have no idea what I'm doing, like seriously. I'm gonna go ahead and use some plain cream cheese. We have our cheesecake mix and our cream cheese in one bowl. So just like in the video when I was making the cheesecake, it just says to mix this mix. That's why I'm kind of skimming over it because I'm assuming that you're a loyal subscriber and you've already seen that video. But um, it literally just says to mix until it's all mix it has like a nice consistency oh my goodness next time definitely not a small bowl i just i have really big bowls and last time i made this in this glass bowl and it wasn't even kind of full so that's why i got the smaller glass bowl and that was not the move okay she's starting to mix my fingers are so dirty Oh crap, this is a no-bake cheesecake. Uh-oh. I'm gonna go ahead and spray my pan. Okay, let's scoop a little filling. Truck to the plane, to the truck, truck to the hotel lobby. Me, I go through underground garages, presidential suites on the deposit. Elevator up to the room, shower up and then we hit the club. Touchdown, gotta see what's up. Area code in my phone, what numbers do I stick? We are just gonna go ahead and drop our cheesecake filling in our pumpkin filling. I am so excited to try this. I do have a single chopstick. I'm gonna go ahead and just slowly mix it around. Still have who do I know from the past? Hit one, she say she got a man. Hit another one, it goes green. Must have changed foes on a team. Remember when you let me in between? That was 2017. All right. I don't want to try it because I don't know if that's all good to go. But I only made a couple, and they look like this. Okay, you guys, as you can see, it's time to make our icing. All right, so it seems pretty simple. It literally just says to take uh, two tablespoons of milk or water and combine this icing powder and stir it until it has a nice consistency. So that's what we're gonna do. One tablespoon, two tablespoons. Now I'm just going to uh, mixy, mixy, mixy. Wow, okay, almost like how is this all it needs? 
but it actually is mixing really well. <gasps> That's why we can't have nice things. The pretty one is definitely gonna be the one that goes with my mom to work. And it smells too good. I will also show you guys the one that I will keep at the house. Well, you know what? I'll tip it over so it can get spread out. I can't wait to try them, but I want to try them with our muffins. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and pull them out right now. I don't know where I left off at in this video, but I do know it is almost nine o'clock at night and I am hungry and I kind of wanted to try a slice of my bread and I wanted to definitely, oh, sorry if you hear that in the background, I'm preparing my coffee for tomorrow. But what I was saying was I want to try a slice of my bread and I also want to try a slice of my cheesecake, pumpkin, bread, cupcake, <laughs> muffin. Um, that is what I'm most excited for if I had to be honest. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get to tasting. This is what the cheesecake muffin pumpkin looks like. It looks so good. It feels so good, you guys. Oh, wow. I'm gonna heat this up just a little, just because it was in the fridge. Um, I do have to refrigerate it since it has cheesecake in it, but I'm so excited to try it. All right. It smells so good. It smells like a candle. Mm hmm So moist. If I had to be completely honest, I think I could pro I probably I don't know. I, I don't know if it's just too moist, <laughs> like it's good, or if I could have cooked it a little longer. but it's really good. Now, for what I've been waiting for all night, I wanna try this cheesecake muffin. You ready? Oh my God. Wow. Are you kidding me? This cheesecake is doing things. approved <laughs> i may insert a video clip of my mom trying it but if i don't i do hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you enjoy the rest of your day or night whichever one you are in and i'll see you in my next vlogtober video bye guys Try this. you can be honest this is my first time no it's good I don't want it, it could just be drier. It's like very moist, both of them. That's still good though. Oh, okay. I like it.